The Poverty Eradication and Social Welfare Ministry introduced a subsidy in 2013 to compensate teachers involved in the Early Childhood Development Programme. For us, the ECDs, we just uh, uh, get our income from the school funds. So now, even, uh, uh, now that there is no more uh, income or school fees coming in, it's a challenge to us because it's not everyone that is benefiting from... Um, this subsidy from Ministry of Gender, the one that Ministry of Gender is giving to the other teachers. So um, for us, we think uh, it is the best. It would be better if Ministry of Gender look at it also. A member of the association, Sarah Moses, said those teachers are no longer motivated to teach as government seems not to appreciate their work. The Ministry of Gender should link up with daycares because we feel left out as if no one cares about us, while they help with early childhood education because the Ministry promised that all daycares will receive the subsidy. Contacted for comment, the Ministry's Permanent Secretary Esther Lusepani says the payment process has been decentralized and all payments are done from the respective regions. Lusepani says only some teachers in the Oshikoto region who did not receive their salaries. She says the Commerce region has started processing the payment as from the 17th of this month. Lusepani also urged the ECD program educators and principals to apply for emergency income grant. Franklin Muningirwa, NBC News, Ventuk.